Hello there. My name is Dylan. And I am personally here. Just for you. And I'm here to tell you that I love you. But also, I'm here to completely blow your mind! So, teaser number one will come to you in a second. But first, we need to do some warm-up activities to help your brain get started. Now, I am all energized and pumped up for math and any other thing that can come at my brain. You! Me? Ask me a math question, any math question, because I'm surely ready for it. Um, three times five. Let's see. You multiply the quantity of x by the positive denominator of five then you should receive a positive answer of 27.532. Uh, sorry dude, that's incorrect. It's 15. Well, what do you know? Math. Me too. Brain teaser number one. Imagine yourself in a boat and you're surrounded by sharks and puffer fish and your boat is leaking how is it leaking well it's probably just because you got you have a guy that just ate a Big Mac in your boat but anyway it's sinking and you have sharks and puffer fish around you and they could eat you if you fall into the water now tell me how do you escape this how do you survive how? How will you ever see another Big Mac again? I'll give you time to think. Get to it, my friends. Have you found your answer? Good. If you haven't, you're stupid and I hate you. But if you have, good job. I'm happy. Unless you get it wrong, because then you're also stupid and I also hate you. But at least you tried. That doesn't matter to me. Anyway, the answer was... All you need to do is stop imagining. That was pretty cruel, wasn't it? Anyway, let's get on to brain teaser number two. Brain teaser number two. Okay, so, you get onto a bus, right? You're just on this big, fat, yellow school bus. Why it's a school bus? I don't know. But let's get to the brain teaser. I'm getting off topic. So, you're on this bus, and you're driving it. And you see the passengers as they come in and out. The first one that comes in is wearing a blue coat. And that's the only one that comes in. And he goes to the back. And he sits there. And he stares at you. And then he comes up to the front and gives you a muffin. And then, four more come in. And they're all jolly. They just got Big Macs. And then, and then, the next person that comes in, oh, he's like as fat as a mammoth. He's like, oh, 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 he could have played Fat Albert and they wouldn't have even needed to stuff him with stuff. And if you didn't know, Fat Albert would stuff with stuff. Anyway, so then, six of them got off, which leaves one. 
Unless my math is incorrect. I think you should do the math because my math is not very good. Even though I did the warm ups, I still forgot to take math during my school. And so, five more people get on. Three get off. 25,000 gets on. Two get off. The question is what was the color of the bus driver's eye? The answer was Well the answer can vary. What are your what's your eye color? Why do I ask? Well, because I said you were driving the bus. So there you have it. Your answer is your eye color. Isn't that great how how the answer varies on, on your your eye color? So that's that. Now let's get on to brain teaser number three. Brain teaser number five. We are going to discuss brain teaser number five because that's what number we are on. Okay, so imagine yourself walking into a forest. How far can you go into the forest? That's my question. Short brain teaser, but that's the question. I will give you time to think. How far can you go into the woods? The answer is you can only go halfway because then you'll be going out of the woods. That's kind of a cruel question, I guess, but you have to admit it's pretty clever, you know. Got a big fat noggin in here and half of it I'm not using. That's what my mother says. On to brain teaser number four. This question is one of my personal favorites. You're in a room. Okay? Imagine you're in a room and no, the answer is not stop imagining this time. You're in a room. All you have in the room is a table. How do you get out? I'll give you some time to think. This one's extra hard so I'll give you a little more time. Alright, this one is pretty tricky, so if you didn't get it, that's alright, but I still hate you and you're so stupid. So, you look at the table, you see what you saw, you take that saw, cut the table in half, two halves make one hole, you climb through the hole, and get out. I know you're staring at me blankly like I have no idea what I'm talking about because I don't. But, still a brain teaser. I mean, some brain teasers, you don't even know what people are talking about. But you can replay that like 20 times if you don't understand what I'm saying, but, you know, I just like it. So, time for brain teaser number seven. Five. I think we're on five. <laughs> 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 
Well, that wasn't really a brain teaser, but if you if you could survive that, well, then you're truly a brain teaser champion because that was probably the most disgusting thing you ever experienced in your life. Well, that was fun. So, I guess uh, I'll see you around. But first, we need to make sure you guys know what what score you got. You know, four out of five, three out of five, two out of five, one out of five, or zero out of five. You're a jack wagon. So, let's go look at our scoreboard. Put up the scoreboard, please. Please. I'm really, really not like I'm smiling like this. So put up the scoreboard right now. All right then, since they're since they're not gonna put up the scoreboard, might as well just talk about how my weekend was. Well, my weekend was pretty good, thanks. And I want to talk. Do 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 do.